Hey guys, this is a quick tutorial on how to download apps on your iPhone. Basically, you just have to go to your app store. So you're gonna look for your app store. So here's my app store right here. If you can't find it for some reason, or just start uh, quicker than, than doing that, just uh, swipe to your left, well to your right, and you're gonna see this. Search iPhone. So you're gonna type in app store up here, and you're gonna see it right away. You're gonna click on that, open it up, and you're gonna pretty much see featured apps at the start. So what I recommend doing is just scrolling down until you see um, new to the app store. Just click on that, and you're gonna see some of the most um, popular apps that people download right away, such as Facebook or YouTube, Twitter, and all those other ones. Um, you're gonna see, as you can see, I have them as open right here. Um, that's because I have them downloaded already. So if I click on open, they'll just open up. If you want to download something like these ones that I don't have, you just click on free. And wait, I'm gonna actually show you with this other one. Um, so you're gonna click on free, and then install app. And it's gonna ask you for your Apple ID. If you guys don't have an Apple ID, you are gonna create one at this point. You can create one without having to insert any credit card information. Don't worry about that. Just make sure to click on none. If you don't know how to do it, you can always check out one of my videos that I have specifically of how to do that uh, for your iPhone, or iPod, or iPad. Um, it's pretty easy. Um, just remember to click on none and you don't have to select the credit card. Um, if you're really having trouble with it, just subscribe to my channel and watch the video. Uh, for now, you can just put in your password if you already have an Apple ID and then click OK. Um, I'm just going to click on Cancel for now. Um, but remember, click OK and it's going to be it's gonna install to your iPhone. You only have to do that once. Uh, once you download it one and you want to download another one, you're going to notice that it won't ask you for your password again. It's just going to start downloading. Um, if you want to check out more free apps and paid ones, you're just going to go to top charts. And from there you can see the first row will be paid and the second row will be your free apps. Okay, um, from here you can just scroll around and download every single one that you want. You just have to click on the app itself. It's going to show you a preview of what it is. And just click on where it says free up here. Um, once again, click on install app. It's going to ask you for your password or not since you downloaded one already. I'm going to click on cancel again just because I don't want that one. Um, let's say you want to see a specific app that you want. Just go to categories, which is right up here. And just tap on that. And you're going to see all these categories that you have. So let's say you want something for your navigation, such as a free GPS. Um, just tap on that and it's going to load up everything that's paid and free. So at this point you can download Google Maps which is uh, an actual GPS. It will guide you to where you want. Um, you can also see other free ones that are there. Or you can look for some paid ones. Uh, for GPS, if you're looking for GPS, I suggest buying something like TomTom Tom or Navigon. They are quite expensive but I think they're worth it. They don't work with your data, so they won't use your data plan, um, Navigon or TomTom. Tom. So <clears throat> it is worth it because of that. Um, that you actually use that GPS uh, signal, satellite signal, to locate where you are and guide you throughout the road. Um, once again, they don't use your 3G data plan or Wi-Fi. Um, so that's how basically you go around them. You can see more stuff uh, such as sports, if you want some games for sports or any apps that are sports uh, paid and free uh, just make sure to click if you don't want to pay anything just look for the free ones and scroll through those um, you can also see your updates right here uh, if you want to update any of your apps now let's say you downloaded all these apps and you want to delete something because you just didn't like it so we're just gonna get out of this so just press your home button for now and let's say I want to uh, delete one of these millions of apps that I have here. Um, just look for one. Then I'm gonna delete. Okay, I'm gonna delete, delete iFitness for now because I just don't use it. So I'm just gonna hold my finger over it. Okay, till I see them moving right now, as you can see. Um, then I'm gonna tap on the X that's right here. Then it's gonna ask me if I really do want to delete it. 
so I'm gonna click on delete and I'll get rid of the app and that's about it guys uh, then just click on the home button now let's say I wanna organize my apps around my iPhone once again you're just gonna hold your finger over one of these apps I'm just gonna hold it on one of them till they start moving around then I can organize them around my board so I'm gonna take this snowboarding one and move it right here okay so you just drag and drop it that's about it if you're done doing that once again press your home button right now I'm gonna make a folder so let's say you wanna make a lot of apps just go into one folder so you're just gonna hold the app and drop it over the other one that you want to make the folder then this folder can be called games or you can change it up just by clicking on that white space and writing whatever you like to write once you've done that just click on done I tap on the uh, back and that's it okay then you're just gonna tap on your home button and you're done with your folder now let's say you made that folder by accident just click on your folder tap on the app move it out of there tap on the other app move it out of that folder and that folder will disappear so that's how you kind of organize your apps how you download them from your app store if you guys have any questions comments I uh, just place them right below and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you for watching